Hello and welcome to Poseidon Tech. In this episode, we will take a look at the new features and improvements of the latest version of ETS 6, 6.1.0. I must say that this update is truly worth the wait. So, let's dive in and update ETS 6 to the latest version. This is the new ETS6 dashboard. The project's overview is really nice, especially now that we can assign images to our projects. Moving on to the local project section, you will notice that it displays the last modified projects. To access the entire local project list, simply click the local projects button. From there, you have the option to view your projects in either icons view or list view, depending on your preference. Now, let's dive in into the Details button. By clicking on it, you can perform various actions. You can edit the project's name. Check its status. And even access its statistics, including the number of KNX devices, areas, lines, segments, and the rooms within the project. It's a convenient way to get a quick view in your project's information. One of my favorite features is the ability to use tags. By clicking on the Edit button, you can create new tags and assign projects to them. For instance, here I've created tags like Hotels, Villas and Poseidon Tech. Now, let's create a new tag called YouTube and assign our project to both YouTube and Poseidon Tech tags. Here comes the exciting part. If we navigate to the Filter tab and select the Poseidon Tech tab, ETS will automatically filter our projects accordingly. And if we want to narrow down the results even further, we can also select the YouTube tag. It's a powerful way to efficiently organize and find projects based on specific criteria. Overall, the new project handling feature in ETS 6 is truly impressive especially when compared to ETS5. The difference is huge. Now, let's open a project. Upon opening a project in ETS6, my first impression is that it has a similar appearance to a web browser, which gives it a modern and sleek look. Take a look at the breadcrumb navigation feature which allows you to easily navigate between different building parts without using the tree view. It's a beautiful and convenient addition. Now, let's move on to the toolbar. It's quite similar to ETS5, but there's one notable addition. The Panels tool, where you can easily open a new panel. At the top of Panels tool, you will notice the Favorites Panels list. From the available panels, drop down menu, in addition to opening a panel, you can also add or remove a panel from the favorites panel list. For instance, I will add the catalog panel to my favorites list. Furthermore, you can split panels horizontally or vertically to customize your workspace. Another useful tool is the Connection Manager, where the default choice is set to Automatic. ETS6 will automatically determine the most suitable bus interface, and if none is found, it will prompt you to select one. From the three dot button, you can access ETS6 Settings, Diagnostics, and close your project. Apart from the Buildings panel, I will also open the Topology panel.
you can easily move panels up or down using the Panels drop-down menu. Or if you select to split panels vertically, you can move them left or right. You even have the options to open panels as new tabs. Or new windows. With the flexibility of ETS 6, you can even work on multiple projects at the same time, enhancing productivity, especially if you work with two monitors. One very nice addition in the sidebar is the group's container for quick drag and drop. Of course, that is not the only way linking group objects with group addresses. Right clicking on a group object and selecting Link With opens the redesigned Link With Group Address window, which is more user friendly and efficient compared to ETS5. Now, let's open the Diagnostics panel and Line Scan tool. First, let's check the Line Scan in ETS5. And now, in ETS6. Notice the significant increase in details available in ETS 6. It's truly impressive. More videos of ETS 6 will follow, but in my opinion so far, the new ETS 6.1 update is all about productivity. And when you consider the new KNX IoT devices that are coming, ETS 6 will become a game changer. At this point, I would like to inform you about the new ETS 6 30% discount from KNX. Take advantage of this offer by visiting my.knx.org. Sign in with your account, click on Shop, and then ETS to select the ETS 6 version that suits your needs, or click on Available Upgrades to upgrade your ETS 5 to ETS 6. Use this voucher to purchase ETS 6 with 30% discount. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next episode.